So I'm using the track leap motion on my desk currently, and probably this is going to be the way I'm going to use it most of the time. So I'm talking to you right now, and I am able to emote with my hands without a problem. But if I were to be typing or, you know, playing a game or something that I need uh, hands on the keyboard, anytime my hands go down, they will reset back to kind of like their generic position because the, the tracker can't see me anymore. When the tracker was on my chest, it could read them no problem. The thing that I like about the one on the desk is I have more range of motion when it comes to my hands if I'm talking to you like this. Moving my hands, you know, pointing at things like that, <laughs> like that, like this. So for me, this works a little bit better for the type of puppeteering that I'm going to do with this character. So it just comes down to what you want to do. I would say if you're going to be gaming, using your hands a lot when it comes to, you know, keyboard and mouse, then definitely stick to the chest one. If you're going to be talking, interacting with your audience, or just kind of doing like a voiceover for a video, I would say the desk one is a little bit better. As you can see, it sees my hands better, in my opinion. I'm gonna really open my hands up and everything. And I know there are certain poses that it will not see as well. Like this one, I can flatten my hand a lot more than you could with the chest, and it still sees it, which is better than the other one. But there are certain times that if I do like this, it will lose its tracking, see? Because it didn't see the upper hand. So as long as you're not overlapping a lot, it's not an issue. I think it's more fluid. And instead of putting my hands on the desk, like right now they're on my desk. My elbows, I mean, are on my desk. Sometimes it'll lose it. I like to kind of push them back a little bit and put them on my chair. So I could even raise the character a little bit here so you can see this. And then this way, see, my elbows are currently on my chair and then I can just talk and it'd be really comfortable. And um, personally, I like it this way a lot, a lot better. <laughs> Sometimes uh, in this position, I, I don't see it as much in the when you have it on your chest. The thumb will fold a little bit more, so sometimes you have to kind of force your thumb out a bit more. But it doesn't really bother me too much. I kind of keep my hands in a way that, that that's not too bad. But aside from that, uh, no, I don't really see much issue. It's Like I said, it's up to you. But I really like desk, flat on desk mode. You can see it right there. You can see my settings. And uh, I like to keep my uh, smoothing up, if you can see it right there. And that's about it. Um, I would say desk mode, great for certain things, and chest mode, excellent for other stuff.